Good afternoon. So today we are going to be doing the King Baboon Slings. Yes, they have already molted. And now we are going to be putting them in these. We have got some coconut fiber over here. Let's get them into these deli cups. I don't think we have enough, but well, let's just do it. So I kept them all in here to prevent rats because mice, rats do come into this room and it gets really, really annoying. So I put them in here. That way, they cannot be accessed by the mice because mice are really annoying and they can eat your tarantulas. Look at this. Look at them. I don't know if you can see them running. So we're going to keep them closed for now while I fill up the delicates with coconut fiber. Just like that. And then now it's time to move them into their enclosures, which is definitely not going to be enough for all of them. But not to worry because we do have more in here. So, yeah. Remember I was telling you guys about rats? Look at that. They come in and they knock over my slings. Oh my god, this is why I hate rats, honestly. I don't like rats, okay? Seriously. They're they're such pests. Anyways, back to this. On the light. Close the door because it's so freaking hot today, man. Oh my gosh. It is legit 32 degrees Celsius, you guys. In Fahrenheit, it should be 89.9. Oh my gosh. So I just switched on the aircon for the tarantulas. Look at the amount of mush. Oh my god. Gosh, I'm gonna have to redo this enclosure. This is my uh, Marshali. And they are still having a good time together and just sleeping around. Okay, and the rehousings begin. Okay, now I'm gonna have to... Ah, uh, this is going to be a pain. There's so many of them. There you go, little one. There's your new enclosure. Got another one. See, this is this is why we separate them from the mum. It's so much easier to capture them. You remember the ones that were in the enclosure? Oh my gosh, that was so hard. All right, let's peel this open and see. Oh my gosh. Look at them bolting. Ah! There you go. There are some dead ones. So yeah, but majority of them are alive. So that's what comes. A lot of them, as you can see, are bolting around, so that's a good sign. Yeah. Come here, little one. Get in the cup. There you go. But we do have a lot of bolty ones. <sighs> oh my gosh. There's so many that did not make it. I think it's because it's so hot this lately. Look at all those. Those are actually like, there. see there's some bolting, but there are some that are, well, a lot of them, I think almost half of them are very, very lethargic because it's so hot. That's the downside about living where I'm at. It is so freaking hot that I often get random tarantula deaths which sucks man it sucks so bad but i mean there's nothing that i can really do other than turning on the aircon and also when i turn on the aircon right it is not like natural fresh air so i think that could affect them as well this one is crazy come here there you go get in there haha -ha. Man, it's so sad to see so many of them not making it. Ugh. Like, I really, really hate the weather over here. It's just not the best for tarantulas. I mean, they do live, but sometimes they can just randomly die. So it kind of sucks bad. And uh, that's why you guys see a lot of random deaths. But I try my best, you know, because like, if I turn on the aircon, the air becomes dry and when the air becomes dry they die as well which is also why i have an air humidifier over there but that can only do so much now the thing is over here our humidity is the best for tarantulas but the man so many are not did not make it but the temperature is so hot that it yeah especially at this time of year it's just so bad, man. So bad. Just, yeah. I don't even know, man. The good thing is some of them are still active. Just like this one over here. Hey, come in. Come into the cup. What are you doing? Ah, where'd you go? Come on, buddy. Let's go. There you go. 
And just like that, I have finished the deli cups. Okay, so I've prepared some more deli cups. Let's see who is the active one. This one seems pretty active. <sighs> I don't know, man. Hopefully these guys will be okay. Yep, okay. Whoa, nice! That's a good sign. There are more active ones. Yeah, but yeah, there are still a lot of deaths because it's like super hot. So that sucks. But yeah, good thing we still have a lot of active ones. Look at them go! Oh my gosh, I got two. <laughs> one by one, guys. One by one. I know you guys are excited for your new enclosures. Come on, let's go! Oh, oh, I see a crazy one. There you are. Let's go! Yeah! Yeah! Okay. There you are. You are one. You are one. Crazy one! Yeah! Let's go! Hey, buddy, where do you think you are going? Nah, you're coming with me. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, you. Okay. Where was the one? There we go. This one. Man, it's so much easier to work with them when you have a container that you have separated the eggs from. Because if you don't, they'll be running around the enclosure and that's gonna be hell. Whoa, okay. There's still a lot of them that are active, so that's good. Hey, there we go. For example, you. There we go. <laughs> and also, I'm really happy that they don't stick to this container. You see, when I just pour them like this, they just slide in, which is awesome because if they stick to this container, I'm gonna need like a brush and try to get them out and it's gonna take so long. Hello, little one. And into your new home. Get down. There we go. Oh, okay. We've got a lot of active ones under here. Look at all of them. Oh yes, look at the amount over here. Oh, they were all hiding under that web. Oh, oh, you think you're escaping? <laughs> nope, not today, buddy. Not today. Look at how active this one is. Round and round the marbury bush, do we? Yeah, I mean, there we go. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. So active. Let's go. Where do you think you're going? Nope. Not anywhere else. Ooh. Oh my. Oops. Whoops. Sorry. Where'd you go? Where did you go? There you are. Ha. You think you can hide from me? No. Whoops. Whoopsie. Ha. -ha. Got you back. Think you can run? Ooh. There you go. I'm sure there are some in this flat. There we go. There's one right there. Hey, get out. There you go. Haha. -ha. Where you want to go? Nowhere. Nowhere. Oh, by the way, comment down below what you guys had for lunch. I had some noodles and it was so good. Okay. There's like two lids connected. You see one hiding here, sneaky little bugger. Haha, <laughs> no, not hiding. Sneaky, huh? Come here. Ooh, this guy is quite fast. There you go. Man, just now in the beginning, I thought like maybe 70% died. But actually, majority of them lived. These are the, the only dead ones. I would say maybe not even 5% that died. So yeah, I think that's a pretty good. I know it's, it's sad, but it happens. And yeah, it's really, really hot over here. So that sucks. But I'm just glad that most of them actually survived. 
So yeah, let's count how many there are. So there are 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. And of course, some are over here. So I would estimate over here maybe about 15 or less. Yeah. But there are still some that are alive, but they're like this, like super, super lethargic. But yeah, that's sad. I would just assume that the egg site gave us about 90 babies. So yeah, guys, anyways, I will see you in the next video. Hope you enjoyed this. Really sad that the heat killed my baby tarantulas, but yeah. Anyways, I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Stay safe. Have an awesome one, guys. Peace.